Hi, so today I'd like to talk about the medical condition known as varicose veins. Now, this is something that you may have seen as you see this image here. Now, you see some adults and also old people develop this condition. Now, this is usually caused by the enlarging and twisting of these veins on your legs. Now, this happens because the valves inside these veins are damaged and then uh, the blood that is supposed to flow back into the heart has starting to accumulate and pool here. Now, this is usually caused by uh, the lack of a fully activated skeletal muscle pump. We know that veins carry deoxygenated blood at a very low pressure, so they need help to pump it back into the heart. Now, this is usually where your leg muscles kick in to help uh, bring this uh, deoxygenated blood back into your heart. So people who do not really exercise their leg muscles, they don't go for uh, exercise regularly, or obesity, or those people who have leg trauma, or even standing at long hours daily, they may develop this type of condition where the veins start to stretch and get twisted and then these blood start to pool there. Now usually a varicose vein usually can be easily treated using manual compression or even just starting to exercise. This condition can get well over time. But if you don't uh, take it seriously, over time it may develop into something much more serious uh, as into something we call chronic venous insufficiency, CVI. The CVI is also possible during a pregnancy, but usually this is when the deep veins in your legs also start to pool blood now. Now this becomes much more serious because it leads to inflammation, fibrosis, tissue death, edema, and so on. So it gets much more serious. And then uh, treatment at this time is usually surgery. And then mainstream treatment, they will just straight away via surgery pinpoint the location of this vein, this damaged vein, and remove the entire capillary network. And this is quite damaging because not only did they remove the damaged one, they also removed uh, healthy veins as well, which we believe is unnecessary. A new, much more uh, experimental treatment is uh, starting to be introduced and it is called Shiva. Now, Shiva proposes to just tying off these uh, damaged veins, such so uh, very similar to closing off a road so that no traffic goes through. So they just tie off these veins to prevent any blood flow. So these blood flows, these bloods will find healthy veins to uh, go through. Now this not only significantly reduces the destructiveness of the previous uh, surgery method, we also can uh, lower the recurrence rate and also potentially use it in future transplant surgeries. So if you do take away anything from this video is that you need to put emphasis in walking and doing regular exercise so that you can prevent developing varicose veins and if you don't have varicose veins you will never have chronic venous insufficiency